Hi, welcome to the Electric Vehicle Center of Competence established by Decibels Lab at RV College of Engineering. I'm Suraj, founder and CEO of Decibels Lab. This Electric Vehicle Center of Competence has been established with Elevate 2021 Government of Karnataka. We have established this in 2022 October. It's been almost a year by now. With the help of the facility which is here, we are conducting various different training programs to create the well-trained human resources for the electric vehicle sector. If you see here as a part of this lab, we have various different type of components of an electric vehicle and where we have different subsystems where the engineers can come and get to know how the components of electric vehicle existed. And we also have the facility that is on the electric vehicle testing. Uh, it's an electric vehicle chassis dynamometer. We're able to test and study the characteristics and behavior of an electric vehicle powertrain. And we also teach the engineers on how to develop those electric vehicle powertrain with the help of the MATLAB and Simulink simulation toolboxes. So then we can see the part of the lab facility that we have established for the purpose of testing the lithium ion cells and characterizing the lithium ion cells. As a part of this lab, we've been studying the behavior of the lithium ion cell at various different charging conditions, discharging conditions, cycle life, study its internal resistance behavior, and specific characteristics of a lithium ion cell. To study the behavior of a lithium ion cell at various different temperatures, so we have a thermal chamber which operates between minus 20 degrees Celsius and up to plus 80 degrees Celsius. So with this way, we can create any different conditions of the environment and get to know how does the lithium ion cell behaves. So when the learners come to our lab at Decibels Lab, they get to experience the complete hands-on approach of learning how to study the characteristics of a lithium ion cell with the help of these testing machines. As a part of this lab, we also have been uh, developing the battery testing facility for the main purpose is to study the thermal behavior and the thermal characteristics of a lithium ion battery. So we are developing a novel approaches of the cooling and the thermal management of the EV battery with the help of studying different type of cooling approaches, maybe the passive cooling, within passive cooling, different type of materials, maybe it is tim or the, the phase changing materials or various different type of materials as well. So as a part of this lab, we also have the battery testing. So we have the lab which can study the battery pack from um, nine volts to 99 volts and charge and discharge at various different charge rates and discharge rates. So at a cell level, we can understand, at the pack level, we can also understand the behavior of the battery pack. To teach about the algorithms that goes in the battery management system, so we have established the hardware kits with the help of the NXP hardware. So where our learners can come and uh, do the modeling and simulation and development of the algorithms using MATLAB and Simulink, but at the end of the day, they have to come and implement the algorithm. So these kits, which are here at the table, will actually help our, uh, the, the learners to learn the things practically where they get to implement the algorithms onto the realistic hardware. So it has been an uh, actively, actively running center for about last one year. We have trained more than about 120 students, uh, which are largely from various different industries across the country, and also we have been supporting students from even different countries as well. And we have been establishing various different industry connections. As a part of the training center here, we have established training programs on battery and battery management systems, uh, motors and motor controllers, in vehicle networks. Majorly, the Tata Motors has been one of our larger customers uh, in taking up the training programs from this center. And we also have customers such as Tidal Electric, uh, Valio, we have been providing training programs for Ingest Road Ryan, and various different companies as well. So this center has been the one of the nodal center as of now in Karnataka. We intended to create more number of centers across the country so that we can create good engineers and trained in human resources for the requirements of the and needs of the uh, EV industry in India today. So if you're interested to create a fantastic lab facility where we can provide a training program for your students, or if you want to excel the training programs for the industry, you can, feel free, you can feel free to reach us out and we will be able to help you in establishing the amazing lab and also help you in providing the necessary training to establish the training programs as well. Thank you.